Top of the morning to you. Ah. Jeez, I tell you what, being back in New Zealand, being back in this room, taking a sip of coffee in front of the camera brings back so many memories, it's not even funny. I've been back in New Zealand for about a week now. <clears throat> it's, um, it's, always, it's always good. You know, there's no place like home. Alice Springs is definitely my second home. If any of you guys saw the last video that I made updating you on uh, where, I, where I'd been, basically, for the last nine months, uh, the reasons why I hadn't produced any content, and where I was going next, which is back to New Zealand for a, for a trip, and, uh, and last but not least, I mentioned that the, the bulk of the content that's going to be coming out from this channel over the next couple of months at least is going to be the Rugby Player Reacts to the Top 100 NFL Players of 2023 video series. And I'm so stoked. Honestly guys, can't contain my excitement. I'll try though. Um, I'm super stoked to report that the first part of the series, which is always, you know, it's, 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 fuck, it's a mammoth task. And I mentioned that a few times in some of the videos, but we have, we've gone from number 100 all the way down to number one, uh, as far as reacting to the players. It was enjoyable as always, um, but very daunting to get going. Uh, but you know, when I, I, I kind of, I, I purposely, well, actually, I didn't really know when it was going to come out. I sort of, I, I did do a couple of Google searches, you know, in June and July, just trying to suss out exactly when it might drop. Um, I was expecting it to drop on YouTube, as it always does, and in fact it has. I think that was about eight or nine days later from when it was initially dropped on the NFL Game Pass, or NFL Plus, whatever it was. So it was dropped initially on there, 100 videos, I think it took about... Yeah, like I said, eight or nine days for the whole entire list to come out. And in the meantime, in the background, I thought, you know what? There's going to be a couple of absolute legends out there that decide to uh, completely rip, <laughs> rip off the NFL, try and get away with it as long as they can, and, um, and, and record those videos and put them on YouTube for us, uh, well, cheapskates, really. For those of us who weren't willing or who just weren't in a position to get... NFL Game Pass or, you know, what have you, there was an option to watch it on YouTube and I've got to say a huge thanks to, to those guys who risked their YouTube channels um, for the betterment of the, um, the, the world of, um, you know, American football fandom and that includes me. So, believe it or not, I was able to keep up with the play and um, on the exact day that the top 10 dropped on NFL Game Pass, and then the next day the whole entire series dropped on uh, YouTube, I was able to actually complete the series. So I've got to give myself a bit of a pat, pat on the back, you know, it's never easy, um, but fuck man, when I've got a mission, and this, this takes me back, like even just being in this room, and it takes me back to 2018 when I saw some success on the channel and I saw a blueprint, you know what I mean? And I thought, fuck man, I'm, I'm just gonna go for it. And that's, that's exactly what I did. I mean, it, it, it sent my health into the ground. Um, it sent my anxiety through the fucking roof. But in the end, we did get to 100,000 subs and, and that's an achievement that no one can ever take away from me. I'm super proud of it. And the older I get, the, the more proud I am because I see channels at 10 or 20,000 subs and I'm like, yes, keep going, keep grinding. And they do. And they're in their own lane. They are in their own niche. But the fucking grind, being in the midst of the grind to get from something like 20,000 up to 50, and if that takes a year or more, you think, fuck, am I ever going to get to 100? And for me, it was so explosive that it took me, geez, it took me like six years to get to uh, 10,000 subs. And then it's, well, it took me about, I don't know, another six months to get from 10,000 to, to, to 12,000. And then started making these reaction videos and it went from 12,000 all the way up to 100,000 in a matter of, yeah, four or five months. And so, yes, I grinded, but it certainly, it wasn't that, it wasn't that, that, that hard graft, that grind. I mean, I, I put in the, I, you know, sometimes it's easy to forget the work that I did put in to get up to that 10 or 12,000 subs. I mean, when people came to my channel, they weren't seeing a channel that had 10 videos or 20 videos. I had fucking, you know, five, 600 videos on my channel. Yes, they were all fitness related, 
because that's what I was into and that's what I'm still into and that's what I do plan on bringing back to the channel at some point but you know just yeah this is just a bit of a bit of an update bit of a reminisce down memory lane and um, now we're here you know 2023 the pandemic is all but over I've spent the last nine months in Alice Springs developing further my relationship with my kids it's been a work in progress you know what I mean I've, I've had to forget certain hopes and dreams and just have faith it may not have felt right at the time but I just had to have faith that it would be the right thing in the end you know I've, I've never really taken too much advice on board from many other people but I have listened you know and that's all you got to do you got to be willing to listen to other people's stories other people's you know um, constructive criticism opinions and do with them what you will and and you know here I am I'm, I'm gonna be back in New Zealand for about a month been here for a week and I'm gonna enjoy it you know I'm, I'm, I'm I deserve it I deserve a bit of a break and I mean you could call it a break but like I said for the first week I've been here um, it's been all go it's been all go to try and get this video series finished and I finally have and so now over the next three weeks I'm gonna really turn down the um, Turn down the, uh, the, the level of, you know, just pressure on myself. And I'm just going to edit as time permits. Every morning I'll be in this room editing, editing, um, getting those videos done. Because my next mission is to arrive back in, a, back in Alice Springs, um, refreshed, ready to go, ready to play dad over the summer. And, but also have these hundred videos in the bank already edited, already uploaded on the channel, ready for me to, to release. Because, you know, yes I could try to get them out and publish them as soon as possible, but I feel like I deserve to take my time. And, and what I also feel that you guys deserve, or at least the people out there who have, who have been willing to come on board as a channel member, um, you guys deserve to see these videos first. Um, I believe, you know, last year a few of you guys came on board as a member because this was a similar similar situation to last year. I, I pumped them out, um, but only for the members at first. And it did bring, it did bring through, you know, um, some incredible people that were willing to do incredible things and, and part with some of their hard-earned money to have the opportunity to to um, become a member. I mean, it's not just early content that you can get through live streams and also through comments. Um, you have a certain color. Uh, I, I believe your name comes up in a green. It's been a while. It's been a while. I haven't hosted a live stream for eight months. I just look back. It's been eight months, man. So that must have been basically when I got to Alice Springs, just before Christmas. Um, live streams, I, I certainly do plan on, on having a few, just Chilling, chilling, kicking back, watching a bit of football, or possibly jumping back on that thing, my uh, my my toy, <laughs> my toy that I've been dreaming about using for the last nine months straight, and I still haven't got back on it. So when I do, you guys will know about it because I'll go on, I'll go online and um and create a live stream and get that going. That'll be fun. So that's my driving simulator. Um. I brought my PlayStation 4 back with me so I could use it. I'm going to leave it here. I'm going to take very minimal equipment with me back over. I'm not going back there to be a YouTuber. I'm going back there to work fucking hard, stack some coin, buy a bigger house for my kids to enjoy. I don't necessarily have to live in it. And also, um, uh, shit, what was I going to say? Yeah, just focus on that, you know, it's, I'm not, it, and if, if and when uh, YouTube sort of rears its ugly head, um, that, that, that inevitable feeling after not having created for a while, uh, as a creator at heart, as an entertainer, you know what I mean, um, that inevitably, that, that, that drive to, to create again comes back. But in the meantime, I'll have these videos coming out, and that's, you know, that's, that's what you get. That's what you get through, um, through putting in the work and, and building a fucking library of videos that you haven't released yet. I mean, it's just like, 
shooting a movie. It's just like shooting a video, a, a, a drama series. You know, you've got all these, all these episodes banked up so that you can release them in time and make the most out of all that work that you put in. Now, I'm, now the last thing I will say, and the, the major difference between me being an entertainer and the, you know, the likes of actors in shows, I'm not going to get a single cent from any of these videos. So I've put in the last two weeks straight shooting them. I'm going to put in the next three weeks straight editing them. And then there's going to be thumbnails and all that shit. Look, I could employ an editor, but that would just be taking more money out of my back pocket. So I'm, I've, I've, already, I've already edited a couple. I've uploaded them for my members. That will continue. But one thing I did have to check is whether I would be able to earn any, any money off these, whether they'd be demonetized or not. And it's always a touch and go kind of thing. But in this case, um, the first two videos have been flagged for copyright, which is fine. You know, my viewers still get to see them. YouTube still makes their money. Well, NFL still makes their money, but I'm not going to see a single cent. And so, you know, I'd never, I'm just, <clears throat> I'm just, I'm just, I, I just bring that to you as the, the great Chael Sonnen would say, I bring that to you because if you were to become a channel member for as little as $2 a month, um, you, that, that money would be um, going straight into my back pocket, you know what I mean? Or at least 55% of it would be. So, um, yeah, I think that's pretty much all I've got to say. This video is going to be titled An Update after being in, in, uh, in New Zealand for a week. And we've had like some terrible, it's been fucking cold, not going to lie, really cold just coming to the end of winter here in New Zealand and being that the South Island is south, uh, one of the closest land masses to Antarctica, believe it or not. Um, yeah, it's, it's going to be cold, but um, it's been a nice, it's been a nice change. We've had a bit of rain. We actually had snow yesterday. So, you know, they do say that the, the land of the long white cloud, New Zealand can indeed have four seasons in one day. I mean, yesterday we had we didn't have any sun, but we certainly had cloud, rain, a bit of bit of bit of bit of frost in the morning, some snow, and then today, blue skies, sunny day. So you never know what you're gonna get. I don't even bother <laughs> looking at the, the the forecast because it's so random, and this could, you know, um, yeah, it could be raining today and uh, later today. It depends how cold it gets, of course. And there, there's, you know, I, I don't look into my weather, weather patterns. All right, I'm no weather man, but I am a guy that enjoys creating videos. I'm a creator. This is my YouTube channel. You guys are the absolute legends who continue to watch, continue to support me, and in return, I will always be open, honest, transparent about where I'm at, my journey, the good, bad, and the ugly. And the, the final thing I will say, if you've been here this long, is that, you know, this, this journey of the last nine months has certainly not been without its, its hurdles. And those hurdles and those real challenges I have brought to YouTube, not on this channel. I just thought it was just too much. I wasn't willing to do that. But I have brought it to my other channel, a channel that has now got 250 subscribers from having zero at Christmas time. And I've, I've really enjoyed seeing that. I've really enjoyed following the growth, um, you know, having, uh, having a, a, a reasonable amount of comments coming through. So that means that I have, um, when I've got time, I, I've, got, I've had the ability to, to get back to every single person. So the community I'm growing over there at my second channel called It's Okay To Talk is a community that is always gonna be positive. You know, it's non-toxic. Um, it's about improving yourself, it's about self-improvement, and it's about being able to talk about your issues. You know what I mean? And, and I've got a fair few. We all do. None of us are perfect. Um, but there's just not that many people that would be willing to broadcast it on YouTube. And you know what? I'm not, fuck I'm not afraid. I'm not scared. Nothing will, like, I'm, I'm not afraid. because I've got nothing to hide, guys. I wear my heart on my sleeve, and I'm proud of that. Nothing to hide unless it was just that personal, you know what I mean? But these are issues that um, a lot of people can, can relate to and that's why I'm making the videos. So by all means, check out my second channel. 
Uh, it's been my absolute pleasure to talk to you this morning. And uh, what I'm going to do is take another sip of my coffee. God damn. And um, I will continue to edit these videos. So thank you. Thank you guys for your support. I am going to shoot a second video um, down at the rugby field. Just having a bit of a run around, you know, connecting with the uh, connecting with my rugby roots again. Um, and I'll, you know, I'll take the camera down and I'll, I'll make a video just fuck, I don't know, kicking some goals or doing some just anything to do with rugby down at the grass, you know, on a good day like this, it'll be fun. I'm really looking forward to that. But for the, for the rest of today, at least, um, I will be editing my ass off for all you channel members. Um, not to say that anyone else doesn't mean as much. And I'm, I'm going to try and make this video a complete one cut take, which is pretty impressive, to be honest. For someone who, you know, says that they kind of can't talk from every now and then. When I do get the opportunity to, uh, we make it count. So it's been 17 minutes. Thank you for watching. The top 100 NFL, sorry, Rugby Player Reacts to the top 100 NFL players of 2023 is indeed in motion. And by the end of today, by the time this video comes out, I would say that the numbers from number 100 down to number 90 will be edited up on the channel and ready for anyone who fancies watching them. So, thank you. And I'll see you in the next one.